but uh, it did show speed to lead and just run down by rock tells so Gina Bell may go forward so they're moving up now I think Caesar can make the odd mistake in the score up but at this stage he's doing everything right let's get shorty showed a good dash from the mobile from a wider draw last time the last time he drew barrier one he was slow away but he was pacing poorly and we spoke with Danny Hill this morning on mobile rolling and she said look this horse is pacing a lot better now so therefore he should be able to show a bit more gate speed than what he did last time from barrier one we're about to find out here's race one at globe derby He's got no speed, let's get shorty. He began a little bit quicker than last time, but Budding Caesar comes across him out wide and will clear them. We'll get across down to the inside without too many problems. Let's get shorty sits on his back, though. He's a bit different, looking for cover. On the case goes forward to give it 1-1 one, one cover. Nikea Courage settles down behind those, and Altimeter is at the tail end of the field. So Budding Caesar, which has been best uh, supported and jumped favoured on the fixed odds, leads away, and Gina's got him out in front by five metres, and they slacken the speed. She drops anchor. They're not going that quickly down the back straight. Showed good dash from the mobile. On the case, facing the breeze, but not putting any pressure on this leader. Uh, on the inside, following the leader, here comes a move. Gator's not happy with the slow tempo of the altimeter and goes up quickly and caught them napping as well. Showed good dash, gets three parts of a length over. Budding Caesar's trying to kick up on the inside, but has still got the feet there. And on the case, was able to drop down to the inside in front of Let's Get Shorty, who did pace a bit roughly when they lifted the tempo there. But they really split the field up there with that dash. 31-1 was the first quarter, but Gator grabs hold now with Altimeda outside the leader. So Budding Caesar's got the inside. Altimeda, Danny gets off and grabs the one-one, but Let's Get Shorty. And on the case, follows the leader. Back behind those, he's a bit different. And at the tail end of the field was Nikea Curry. So complete different different order to what we had a lap ago and now they're starting to see you from the tail end of the field he's a bit different coming three wide or trying to but not improving quick enough towards the 600 second quarter was 28 3 59 4 leaders being tested budding caesar a long neck altimeter outside the leader let's get shorty one out one backs right on the back of altimeter and ready to come three wide on the case is dropping off not holding its position daddy goes down to the inside there well let's get short he's going to try for a, a sprint lane run he's a bit different trying to improve around the outside. Nikea Courage is coming with it on the case, dropping out. He's going to run last. Still in front, budding Caesar. 29-7 the third quarter. Let's get Shorty's being tickled up to try and keep its back. About to go for a sprint lane. Then Altimeda. Behind those was Nikea Courage. Budding Caesar. What's he got left for the finish? He's in front by five metres. Looks a big enough lead. It is. He kicks away. He's home. Budding Caesar careers away now over the concluding stages. Just too good. Let's get Shorty eight metres away in second place. Nikea Courage a further eight metres third, then Altimeter behind those, he's a bit different and on the case was at the tail end of the field.